Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach. I follow Weight Watchers and I track, track calories and macros. Happy end of 2022, happy top 22 foods of 2022. These are the 22 foods that I have been loving this year. It took me a while to figure out my top 22 because I actually tried a lot of things I really enjoyed this year, but these 22 foods have really helped me on my 135 pound weight loss. So if you're excited to see my top 22 of 2022, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not because I upload five videos a week and I have a lot of great content coming your way in the new year. Down in the description box, I will link everything I share with share with you today with the exception of the foods that can be found at your local grocery store. Everything else will be linked down below for you as well as nutrition coaching. Highly recommend having your macros and calories done so that you can make 2023 a great year and I have one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability as well. Links and discounts to my other favorite things and my Facebook group. Come join us there. We'd love to have you are also in the description box. So I'm really excited to share with you my top 22 of 2022. goodness, where to begin? My desk is covered with all of the foods. Now, there were a few things that I'm out of. Uh, they're my favorite foods, so they're gone. Restocked them in my house yet, so those items, I will just pop a picture up on the screen, but the majority of my favorite foods I have sitting right in front of me, so let's get started. First, with this beauty right here. This is the Kodiak Protein Packed Power Flour. I discovered this towards the end of the year and fell in love with this. It tastes just like regular flour. You can use it in place of regular flour in baking. Anything you would use flour in, supplement with this protein flour. For a quarter cup, it's 110 calories and you're going to get 10 grams of protein. It's only two points per serving on WW, so you're saving a point and you're getting in 10 grams of protein for every quarter cup of the flour. Now, I find this at Walmart. It's in the flour, sugar, baking section and I love this. This bag is almost gone. I think I've been through three or four of them obsessed with this. One of my favorite finds of 2022. Next up is a protein powder. I actually have a few protein powders to share with you. You know that I've been really into hitting a protein goal all year long. It's really contributed to me being really successful this year with my weight loss. So I've discovered a few protein powders that have been staples for me. And the first one is Ghost, especially the Chips Ahoy. I love this protein powder. 160 calories, 25 grams of protein. You can buy this right off of Amazon, GNC, Vitamin in shop. I'll have it linked for you. This is so good. There's little bits of cookies, little bits of chocolate chips. I love to bake with this. I love to just make a blended milkshake style protein shake with this. It's just a really versatile protein powder and it tastes absolutely incredible. It's been one of my favorite kind of sweet protein powders. Next up are these. These may be a little weird, but I really have grown to love these. These are the Wassa multi-grain crisp bread crackers. Now I really like these as a bread replacement. So one of my favorite things to do with these crackers is to put tuna salad on it or egg salad in place of bread. It adds a nice crunch, a nice texture. They're only 35 calories a piece. They have two grams of protein and they're packed with whole grains and fiber. And in my opinion, they taste really good. They add that good crunch that I miss sometimes with a regular sandwich. And again, it's only 35 calories. You can use one or two of them, load it up with your favorite protein. You could even put your sandwich components on here, like a meat and cheese. Really, really delicious. And I've repurchased these several times. And my favorite, like I said, is the multi-grain Swedish style Wasa cracker. Next are Ver Bars. They have come out with some amazing new flavors this year. This one is the cookie butter. I really, really like this one. These are little caffeinated bars so that you're going to get about a shot of espresso's worth of caffeine in here about 65 milligrams they're only 90 calories and they taste incredible all of their flavors are so so good they're a great pre or post workout snack i love these as an afternoon pick me up i keep these in my purse in my car in my desk drawer they're just a great way to get a little pick me up a little boost when needed they do make some decaffeinated bars as well so if you're sensitive to caffeine there are some decaffeinated bars but they're so good 
And for three to four points per bar, only 90 calories, they are a staple for me. I eat them several times per week. I have my family eating these. I have my neighbor eating these. These are just really, really delicious bars. I forgot to mention that besides the caffeine that's in here, all of the energy comes from organic green tea. So I'll put Verb down below for you with a discount. Next up are these chips. I heard about these on Shark Tank. I love that show and it's still on. It's still on some channels. These are the Quavos Egg White Crisp Chips. So these were actually chips made out of egg whites. And what excited me about these is that there's eight grams of protein, they're gluten-free, and there's only four net carbs, and they taste amazing. They taste like regular potato chips. You would never, ever know that these are made from egg whites. This is the cheddar. It's 150 calories per bag, and again, eight grams of protein. You can't beat that in a chip. I buy these right off of Amazon in a variety pack with several flavors. Actually, all of the flavors are really, really good. So if you like a good crunchy snack, but you want to get your protein in, highly recommend Quavos. Let's talk about another protein powder, Ascent. Oh my gosh, I love Ascent. I actually bought a single sample at Sprout, tried it out, fell in love with it, immediately went onto Amazon, which is where I buy this, best price on Amazon, bought the lemon sorbet, and I love this. This is their Native Fuel Whey. I recently just purchased their Native Fuel Casein, which is a little bit slower digesting protein, which helps with muscle growth, which lends to my 2023 goals. So I actually have both of the Ascent protein powders. I love these because the ingredients are really, really clean in here. 120 calories, 25 grams of protein, and the lemon is so good. Blend it up with some Fairlife milk, we'll get to Fairlife milk, and some frozen blueberries, and it is so incredibly delicious. All of the flavors of Ascent are incredible, really nice, clean, healthy, high quality protein for a really affordable price. And again, it can be delivered to your doorstep from Amazon. Let's go back to another chip because I love a good chip. <laughs> these are the wild protein chips. Now I saw these on someone's YouTube channel and I thought that's really weird. A chip made out of chicken, how can it be good? They're delicious, I love them. I have repurchased these so many times. My favorite is the sea salt and vinegar. There's a barbecue, there's a honey mustard, there's a chicken and waffles. They're such good chips. These are made from chicken breast, egg whites, and bone broth. There's 10 grams of protein per serving. There's only two servings in the bag, so you get a lot per serving, and it's about 20 chips, and again, 10 grams of protein. They don't taste like chicken. They taste like chips. Now there is a little bit of a chicken on the back end aftertaste, but not really. I mean, you're getting more of the flavor and the crunch of a chip with 10 grams of protein. Love, love, love these. I buy mine at Sprouts. I've seen them at Whole Foods. I've even seen them at regular grocery stores. So just check in your chip aisle. Let's go to Fairlife Milk since I mentioned that with the protein powder. This has been something I discovered that is the only milk I purchase for myself. I don't buy almond milk, oat milk, soy milk. I don't buy any of that. I buy Fairlife because in one cup of low-fat Fairlife, it's 80 calories, 13 grams of protein. Now there's no protein in almond milk. So that's not something I'm going to choose because I'm all about the protein. And this is regular milk, lactose-free, ultra-filtered milk with 13 grams of protein per cup. So like I said, I like to make blended up protein shakes with this or anytime I'm using milk in anything, it's always going to be Fairlife because 13 grams of protein in one cup. Now pasta. We love pasta in this house and I love fiber gourmet pasta. I share this a lot here on my channel. They actually reformulated the pasta this last year, repackaged it. I like that it's in a box. It used to come in a bag and it just wasn't as easy for storage. I love that it comes in a box. It comes in multiple shapes. We have elbows, which is what I have here, rotini, penne, and a spaghetti noodle. It's 110 calories per serving, so three points versus six points for regular pasta, 24 grams of fiber, 17 net carbs, and seven grams of protein per serving. It tastes just like regular pasta, but it's half the calories, half the points, and you're getting in fiber and protein. I buy mine off of Nutrition. I find that they have the most affordable price and the biggest selection. We always have at least 10 boxes in our house. It's honestly the only pasta that we use. Taste, texture, everything is the same. It's just 
way less calories, way less points, more fiber, more protein. So I'll put nutrition down below for you. Definitely order some fiber gourmet pasta. Here's another thing I discovered this year that I have bought time and time again. I actually eat this a lot in my what I eat in a days. These are the Gilbert's Crafted Sausages. Now this one is the bourbon apple chicken sausage. I love the sun-dried tomato one, the caprese, and then they have an Aloha one that's kind of like a sweet tropical. These are amazing. They are individually packaged. So once, so you can only open one sausage at a time I love that. They are about 120 calories a piece, 12 to 13 grams of protein, really clean ingredients, and they taste amazing. I absolutely love them. I love them for breakfast. I love them for lunch. I'll even throw these on the grill in place of hot dogs during the summer, so that it's just a healthier option. The Gilbert's is my all-time favorite. It just has the cleanest ingredients, the best flavor, and I love that there's 12 grams of protein and that they're individually wrapped. I always find mine at Walmart. I actually get asked a lot where I buy these Walmart. In the same section, you're going to find other sausages and bacon. Love, love, love these. Catalina Crunch. This is another thing I discovered this year. Again, I bought a couple sample packs at Sprout. Fell in love with them, went on the Catalina Crunch website, ordered everything. I did a whole taste test on all of the Catalina Crunch products. I love them all. I love their snack mixes. I'll pop a picture in right here. I'm out of those right now. That's how much I love them. But I also love their cereal but not as cereal. Like I don't put milk in this. I just use this as a crunchy snack. My favorite is the cinnamon toast, but all of them are really, really good. You can have an entire half of a cup for 110 calories and there's 11 grams of protein. They taste really good. Super crunchy, super flavorful. This one is cinnamon toast crunch vibes all day long with 11 grams of protein. It also has nine grams of fiber and zero sugar. I love Catalina Crunch. I have ordered multiple times from their website. I actually have a discount for their website. I'll put it in the description box for you, but this is a brand I have really fallen in love with this year. I'm going to share with you two things next because I feel like these kind of go hand in hand. First is yogurt. Now I like all yogurts. This this one though is my favorite. This is the Chobani Zero Sugar. This one's in mixed berry. I like all the flavors, but what I like to do with this yogurt is this. This is freeze dried fruit crisps. All that's in here is bananas and strawberries. There's multiple kinds of freeze dried fruit out there. I just make sure that I buy one that has no added sugar and I count it as zero points. It's just fruit that's been freeze dried and it is a serving of fruit. So the same as I would eat in whole form. So for me, I count this to zero and I top my yogurt with it and it adds a crunch and a sweetness and it is so good. I mean, any yogurt, you can put this on any yogurt. I love, love, love it. One of my subscribers, one of my coaching clients told me about it and I fell in love with it. I buy cases off of Amazon. This one's my favorite. This is the all Brothers All Natural Banana and Strawberry. I'll link these down below on Amazon. I have them delivered to my doorstep. Individual little packages, 45 calories, top your yogurt, complete game changer. Let's talk about one more protein that I love and that's Vade. Now I took these with me when I went on my trip to New York. I love these for travel, for on the go, to keep in your desk at work, keep in your purse, keep in your car. What's really cool about these is these are individual packs of protein. This is one serving of protein. It's in a kind of plastic gel-like packaging. It's the same as what's used on vitamins. So it dissolves when entering into water. This whole pack in your water bottle or shaker bottle, shake it up. It completely dissolves and you drink it. And it is some of the best protein. It is so good. I love the chocolate milkshake. I've tried the vanilla. I've tried the cappuccino. They're all really, really good. It is a hundred, it's only 90 calories per pack and it's going to pack 20 grams of protein. So convenient. Throw it in, shake it up, drink it, 100% dissolvable food grade material. It says 20 grams of protein, sugar-free, lactose-free, on-the-go protein packs. I love these. These have really been a big game changer for me to get in my protein on the go. I don't want to take a whole bag of protein with me. I don't have to worry about putting it in a little baggie. I just take a Vade packet, throw it in my shaker bottle and drink it and get in 20 grams of protein and it tastes amazing. So I'll link them as well with the discount. Speaking of protein, here's another thing I recently discovered the last few months. I have it on auto ship on Amazon. These are the protein H2O waters. This is just the regular protein infused water. I also buy the electrolyte infused. I kind of go back and forth between the two. This is peach mango and it's going to give you 15 grams of protein. This one is 70 calories. Most of them range from like 60 to 80 calories 
calories and they're one or two points on WW, but you're getting 15 grams of protein. You can get in some electrolytes as well. And this is the only protein water I like. I think all the other ones are disgusting. I hate them. This one has no protein taste at all. It tastes a lot like vitamin water. That's what it reminds me of is just plain vitamin water with 15 grams of protein. Love these, love, love, love these. They're affordable on Amazon. Like I said, they're on subscribe and shave, save. They get shipped to me once a month. Love, love, love them. I'll link the regular and the electrolyte for you. Now here's something I don't have in my house because I ate them all. These are from the brand Drizzlelicious and these are little mini rice cakes. These are so good. They're drizzled with all the good things. My favorite is the birthday cake one. I really, really love it. I buy them on Amazon. I'll link them for you. You can often find them at TJ Maxx, Ross, Home Goods, Marshalls. You can find them there as well, but I love them. You get a whole bunch in the serving, so you feel like you're getting a lot of dessert for the points and calories. It's only about 100 calories and three to four WW points. I just love them. They're the perfect little crunchy sweet treat. And the other, one of the other items I don't have on hand is actually the Lahi or Lolly Morning Bites. I bought these at Costco. I've eaten them all. I love these. If you can get these at Costco, grab them. These are little autumn flavored protein bites. They have chicken sausage and squash and vegetables and all these really good herbs and spices. They're about that big, about the size of a silver dollar. You can microwave them, put them in your air fryer, put them in your oven, and four bites is a serving and you're getting 10 grams of protein. I love to pair it with my little yogurt freeze-dried fruit combo, cottage cheese, put it with some eggs, some bacon. Such a great breakfast option and they're super easy. I mean, a minute in the microwave and you have a breakfast with 10 grams of protein. Highly recommend. Here's another product that if you follow me at all, you know I'm literally in love, obsessed, eat every day, and that's American Dream Nut Butter. I love American Dream Nut Butter. Everything about this just speaks to my heart. They are flavored nut butters, lower in points, lower in calories than traditional peanut butter, more protein, and there's mix-ins. There's little good stuff mixed in, whether it be cookies or candy pieces or hot fudge or marshmallow. This particular one is the French Toast Almond Butter. This one has seven grams of protein, five carbs, and 11 grams of fat, and is only 150 calories per serving, which is two tablespoons. Now, normal peanut butter, 190 calories for two tablespoons, way less protein, more fat. This is just a great nut butter alternative to regular peanut butter. They have almond butter, peanut butter, and cashew butter. I love them. I love American Dream Nut Butter. I eat it every day. My favorite way to eat it is on a rice cake, whether it's a plain rice cake, caramel rice cake, chocolate rice cake, any rice cake. I love American Dream Nut Butter on that as a snack. It is so good. I mean, I can't tell you how good this is. It's absolutely incredible, incredible. It's a small business. Love to see it. Love to support a small business. I have about 20 jars in my house at all times. I love it. I eat it every day. Please, if you haven't tried it, grab the American Dream Nut Butter. So amazing. I will link it down below with 10% off. For water, I fell in love with Mio Lemonade. So my best friend Rachel, when we went to Hawaii, brought this with her and I didn't bring any water flavoring. And so I thought I'm gonna try her lemonade one. Love it. I've purchased multiples of the big one. It is just a really good lemonade flavor. It's not too, too sweet. It's kind of on the tart side. Just tastes like legit, really good lemonade. Zero points, zero only zero calories, and it's a great way to flavor your water and help you get your water in. Listen, if you have to add flavoring to get your water in, do it. It's more important that you get your water in than worry about a little bit of water enhancer. This one, though, is my all-time favorite. Let's talk about something else that I love that I'm out of. I need to actually get on Amazon and order some, and that's the NYX sticks. I buy the green package, which are the turkey meat sticks. They are grass-fed, grass-finished, 100% clean ingredients, and you get two both of the sticks in the pack for 75 calories, two points and 10 grams of protein. I mean, it is one of the best bangs for your protein buck. They taste really good. They're soft. They're not dry. They have really good flavor and excellent clean ingredients. I love them. I literally went through an entire case of them. That's how much I love them. I keep them in my purse, in my car, in my desk drawer. And like I said, I'm out. So as soon as we're done here, I'm going to go ahead and order myself another case off of Amazon. And one more item I don't have on hand and another thing that you see all the time in my videos is my favorite cottage cheese, which is good 
culture. Now, I don't discriminate on the kind of good culture. There's a keto one, there's a full fat, there's a low fat. I'll buy whatever is in stock. I prefer the low fat one, just I like the taste and texture better. If I don't buy the low fat, I buy the full fat, which is the dark blue container. The green container, the keto is probably my least favorite. But like I said, I don't discriminate because good culture is the best cottage cheese ever. It has clean ingredients, no carrageenan. Look at some of the store brand cottage cheese out there. There's carrageenan in it, which is an inflammatory. It's a thickener. So it goes in things that need to be thickened like cottage cheese. Good culture does not have it and has perfectly clean ingredients and is amazing. It is the best tasting, best texture, small curd cottage cheese. I'm out because I go through like two or three a week and my husband loves it. We all love it. So that for me is a staple. Next up, I have a healthy eating all the time in Go Bars. This is another small business. She makes these amazing bars. Now these are a little bit higher in points, six or seven points per bar, but they have really clean ingredients. They're all nut-based bars and they range from about 200 to 220 calories. I buy the ones that have protein. So she's got a whole line that contain a lot of protein. This one actually has 15 grams. And this is the peanut butter low carb protein bar and chocolate mint. There's a blueberry chocolate, a peanut butter, a chia one. I really like the chia one. I just make sure when I'm on her website that I'm buying the ones that have at least 10 or more grams of protein in them. These are great quick, easy breakfast for me. I usually have these on the days that I film videos because I don't have time to make a breakfast and I get in 15 grams of protein, nice clean ingredients. I'll definitely be eating these in the new year with my whole cleanup of my diet just because they're such a great protein bar option. Again, small business. I'll link them down below. She did give a 10% discount code for you guys as well. I don't make any money on it, but you'll support her and you'll get some great healthy protein bars. And last, but certainly not least, we're going to end out with candy because I have a sweet tooth and I love candy. And this brand is a new discovery for me this year. This is Chalk Zero. Now I did a whole review on Chalk Zero. I actually ordered a lot of the things on their website. I had an advent calendar from them this year where I got a piece of Chalk Zero chocolate every day. This chocolate is incredible. It is a zero sugar chocolate. It is low carb. It is low calorie. It is a low point. Everything I've tried is absolutely amazing. These are their milk chocolate caramel squares, which is like Ghirardelli squares. This is their peppermint chocolate that was here for the holidays. They have chocolate dipped almonds. I mean, Chalk Zero is in Incredible. I ordered a ton of the products on their website. I've been loving them. I pretty much eat this every day. It's been a great go-to sweet treat for me because it doesn't have a lot. It doesn't have any sugar. It doesn't cause any stomach digestive upset for me. Tastes just like regular chocolate and it fits into my healthier approach to the new year. So I am going to go ahead and stock up on some more Chalk Zero. I love their syrup. I mean, they have a cookie butter, you name it, they've got it. I'll link them down below with a discount as well. So those are my top 22 foods foods for 2022. I could have went on and on. I mean, I have so many new foods that I discovered this year that I love, but these 22 are ones that I eat daily. I mean, I eat the majority of these foods on a very, very regular basis, hence why I'm out of, out of a lot of them. They are really good, healthy, great ways to get in protein. Like I mentioned, I'll link everything down below with discount codes. All of the things that aren't linked, you can find at your local grocery store, but all of the information will be in the description box for you so you can do do some easy st shopping, stock your house up with these good things for the new year. And of course, if you enjoyed today's video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, because I have lots of good stuff coming out in the new year and I do upload five videos per week. Along with everything I shared with you today in the description box, I'll also link nutrition coaching, my other favorite things, and of course, come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Here's to ending 2022 and to making 2023 the best year yet. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.